Ms. Transformers 96 here with another video review. This time of Transformers 2 Revenge of the Fall and Mixmaster Constructicon. Um, I was doing all four Constructicons and um, I've already done Demolisher and Rampage and now I am to uh, Mixmaster and the next review will be Lawn Hall. So I'll get Lawn Hall out of the way and focus on Mixmaster. Um, I, the mixing mode is fantastic. It's just great. I mean, there is not one flaw, no quality issue. Um, I meant a uh, no, uh, yeah, no quality issues. He is just fantastic. He looks great. Big two massive Decepticon symbols, which is really nice. And uh, some reviewers were questioning if he had in that movie, and obviously, if you've seen the movie, he does. So a uh, very movie accurate, and uh, he just looks great. Um, uh, you know, not a lot of kibble. You've got some stuff down here, but it's 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 okay. It looks fine. And um, if you actually want to, you could flip out his gun and have his gun over here, and uh, like he shoots an Autobot behind him or something. Um, and uh, you can shoot this by uh, pressing the button, and he will shoot this purple missile. Uh, it looks very nice since he does have some purple highlights in him, and uh, looks great. But, uh, totally, um, you can't see the gun right now, uh, when it's folded in, which is really nice. And, um, he is just great. Mixmaster is my favorite, uh, character in the second movie, uh, aside from Devastator. So, um, it's really nice to have a toy of him. I'm glad they made it and not just didn't do anything with it like Scrapper or, um, Hightower Overload, how they didn't even make a toy for them. So, uh, it's nice to see this one. So, uh, this is probably the hardest one to transform of all the Constructicons. So, uh, let's get started, see if I can do without making too many mistakes. So, just go fold this in, fold this down, and, uh, fold the ladder up. Okay, now, so, uh, just kind of want to work on this. Just split this, split this, just move it to the side, and transform the arms. Go and split this and fold out the fingers. And there you have his arms and if uh you know he kinda looks neat like he's driving and he transformed his arms to flip some cars over or something. I think that looks kind of neat. I definitely like that. So, um, if you want to kind of leave it like that, that's fine. Uh, just whatever. Um, and just kind of, oh, move the top up and then snap this whole thing. And you're just going to want to unpeg this that was down here and then split them. Down, flip the gun up. Oh, get this one out of your way. Flip it up. Oh. Okay, just shot the missile. So, uh, but uh, I'm on the floor right now, so shoots the missile very easily. And then, um, kind of move this. Okay, bring this whole thing down. Oh, sorry. Unsnap this. Fold this up. Just kind of snap all the the three little pieces um, together, and then uh, move this up, rotate this down, move this like this, we'll keep it up, something like that. Um, yeah, there you go. I think that's how you do it. But uh, that's really up to personal preference. There is an exact way to do it. Oh yes, these things fall off, but they snap in relatively easy. Or maybe not. There you go. Move it up and fold these down. It's really up to personal preference. I think it kind of looks nice like this. If this is the official way to do it, just uh, let me know. Just comment or something. And, um, now the feet. Okay. So move this up and to the side and fold down the toes. Same on this side. Move this up and to the side and fold down the toes. Okay, now, 
now we've got the, oh yeah, this has some trouble staying on, just snapping in, make sure it stays, it might come off during transformation, but just keep snapping it in, and eventually it should stay. Um, move these like this, so let's rotate it, move it back here, perfect, and then um, with his legs, just move it up, rotate it down, and there you go, move it up, rotate it down, and uh, make sure that the toes are pointing forward. And there you have Mix Master, which uh, looks really nice. So let's just get him up, okay. And uh, he isn't leaning up against the wall right now, he does uh, fairly stand up quite well, and um, he looks just pretty nice. Here is the missile, and there he looks very nice, big Decepticon symbol right here, that looks just great. He, he looks fantastic, head sculpt is just amazing to me, and uh, he just looks very, very nice. At first, when I first saw this guy before the movie came out, I really didn't like the way he looked, but after a while, I've very much grown on this guy, and now he's my favorite. He just looks great after you get used to him, and he just, he's a very kind of different, kind of like a bat almost, uh, kind of different transformer, but uh, just looks great. Um, pretty difficult, not too bad though. The beginners, it's probably a little bit harder, but uh, it's not horrible after you transformed him a few times. A um, few quality issues, this arm right here has some trouble standing up. Uh, staying up so uh, it folds down very easily just like that and um, the other thing that's really horrible is these panels up here fall off immediately I mean they just have some serious trouble staying on so uh, and then they're a little bit difficult to get on you know you can get them on but it's a little bit difficult so those are annoying I just like to not even think about them not even bother um, but the panels do look great and uh, uh, what's nice about that you can take these off is um, kind of uh, put them into the pose of uh, the scene at the end and uh, one of these panels gets shot off so you can take a panel off to really create the, um, the end of the movie kind of pose. So uh, he's a very nice figure. He does transform three ways and the other way is the tank that he actually does do in the movie. I'm not going to do that. I've never transformed him into that mode. It's just a little difficult, but he just looks great in that mode. Just very solid, too, but uh, he just looks fantastic in that mode. Uh, so uh, go to Pengu, or however you say his name, but uh, you know who I'm talking about, the reviewer, to find them, uh, the third mode and see how to transform that way. So a uh, great figure. Pick him up if you can. Thanks for watching.